High school baseball diamond now Westbrook hosted Felmouth. Brennan Rumpf led off the game with a double and then will score on the single by Ethan Hendry to give Falmouth a quick lead here. Then the second inning, Hendry will single up the middle to knock in Sam Shapiro. Falmouth then scored 20 runs in the third on its way to a 28 to 1 win. Jacoby Porter had five hits and knocked in seven runs. At Hadlock Field in Portland, Deering hosted Sanford a big afternoon for Spartan senior Ben Gill. Sanford already with a 3 to nothing lead in the third when Gill rips one to right field and he'll circle the bases for an inside the park homer. Gill had five hits in the 17 to 4 Sanford win. In high school softball, Chevrolet hosted Scarborough. The Red Storm with a runner on in the sixth, but freshman pitcher Addison DeRoche gets one of her 15 strikeouts in the game. In the bottom of the inning, Sadie Collins tripled with two outs and then scores on the infield single by Kelsey Cassidy. Chevers win six to nothing. DeRoche threw a no hitter. In boys lacrosse, Yarmouth hosted Greeley. It was all Clippers in this matchup here. Colby Carnes with the laser to make it 10 to one Yarmouth. 22 seconds later, George Brown sets up Hawkin Yo in front of the net to make it 11 to one Clippers. Matt Kane will add a goal a few minutes later and Yarmouth wins 17 to one. They are four and oh. The Freeport girls travel to Waterboro to take on Massabesic. Massabesic and the Mustangs goalie Taylor Lombard makes the save on the free position chance by the Falcons. But then just moments later, Kylie Weber will set up Mia Levesque for the goal to give Freeport a 9-7 lead. 15 seconds later, Lana DeRusso adds another goal for the Falcons and Freeport wins that 11-8.